have been groups of uh, uh, engineers that, uh, that have come out that oppose the technology being used in the Protect IEP Act, namely DNS filtering. And the objection is that it would destabilize the internet by uh, getting people to move away from the formal official DNS system of the internet and B, um, make the internet less secure because it, it would threaten a protocol called DNSSEC or uh, DNS security extensions, which is um, essentially, uh, uh, you know, DNS itself is like the phone book of, of the internet and DNSSEC is like the secure phone book of the internet that facilitates secure communications. I think that those objections are unfounded because based on the evidence that we have, um, the concerns were based on um, hypothetical situations, but based on the evidence, uh, the, the pirates have not come up with a system to subvert the official DNS system of the, of the internet. What they've done is come up with patches that work in conjunction with the official DNS system of the internet. And B, uh, when it comes to DNSSEC, all the uh, opponents of, of DNS filtering say is that the Protect IP Act would make it uh, not possible to implement DNSSEC for those sites that have been filtered. Well, the purpose of DN the, the purpose of DNS filtering is to completely break those sites altogether, and not just the security aspects of those sites. They, the opponents of <coughs> DNS filtering do not do not uh, assert that it would break DNSSEC in a general case where um, uh, sites that are legal and, and not filtered would be broken in any way. So those, those are my main points. Okay, thanks George.